Hello everyone. Welcome to the Laravel design pattern series. Today in this series we are going to discuss about what are the Laravel design pattern, what are their benefits and how to implement them into our real time project. So basically we are going to discuss about design pattern. So first question arises that what are the design pattern? So basically design pattern are used to used for three basic purposes three main purposes the first one is used for structuring our the our project and then second we are using this for improving our performance and then third we are improving this for our uh, readability so our uh, code is more readable so if our application is going bigger so it's hard to maintain our project structure and its readability so this uh, pattern will guide you how we can improve our code and uh, based on the performance and structure so let's uh, start it with this uh, uh, blog so i am following this blog and this blog is written by this code source.io so don't forget to read this uh, blog because it's written very well blog so i'm personally impressed with this blog so here what are the design patterns and how many design pattern exist in the laravel so before going to start i'm going to tell you that who i am so my name is dayat niazi and i am full stack web developer and i'm shooting uh, different uh, videos on the laravel almost daily and i'm also shooting playlist on the laravel so you can get uh, many playlist from this youtube channel i have shooted advanced and uh, also beginners and intermediate level series jquery ajax with laravel set up vs code if you are a laravel developer you you should must watch this series where i talk about how you can boost your development process because you can install the extension so you can also check my vs code so how my project look like so it's more readable than simpler one okay so i have also a series about laravel pdf series where you can generate different type of uh, pdf uh, you can also add the custom css and stuff like that if you are uh, native uh, in hindi or urdu so you can also get this full course uh, which is in the laravel 9 so it's full advanced level course be beginner to advanced level course integrate admin dashboard so it's full in english laravel advanced email series so it's also full in english so you can send different mails based on the activated theme okay laravel http client this is about uh, restful apis zoho integration this is also about the restful apis laravel multi role authentication and there is much more things so you can we will get to uh, benefit from this channel and there is also a community tab where i am uploading different tips and tricks on this channel so here it's not to uh, load it properly so let's uh, wait to uh, for a moment to load this properly so here with count to uh, with count to uh, where you can also chain queries here and get the count to uh, and you can also uh, check out different to uh, uh, different tips and tricks basically this uh, channel is uh, mostly this channel is about laravel so i have uploaded uh, almost 400 plus videos which is uh, where 350 are on the laravel so hope uh, don't forget to check them out and share it with your friend so now let's come to our our topic our topic is laravel design patterns so how many design pattern exist in the laravel so there are these uh, uh, six design pattern exist in the laravel the first one is builder pattern and then second one is factory pattern third one is strategy pattern provider pattern repository pattern and facades uh, facade pattern so these patterns are exist in the laravel so it's totally your personal preference which you um, which you are interested to do this in your personal preference because i personally like this repository pattern so i like the way that how they are going to organize their uh, their code using this repository pattern so i personally like this and i most of in my project i am implementing this one and we are also going to start with the repository pattern and i am going to shoot a full series on it the first uh, in this first video i have created a demo project and in the demo project project we are going to implement this into our real project right so i am going to implement this repository pattern so if i got uh, 
10k views on this uh, repository button and uh, some uh, more uh, good comments so then i will shoot uh, videos on builder factory and stuff like that for now i'm focusing on this repository pattern and it's uh, very much uh, pretty straightforward so i'm going to walk through all of your all of uh, the process so hope you will like this series so subscribe the youtube channel and stay connected for the upcoming videos so you can get the regular update so i will post uh, this video first day and then you can get the second video on the second day and third and stuff like that so hope you will uh, get uh, some benefit from this channel so i will meet you in the next one bye bye